Hey guys, Juan here. And in this video, I'm going to walk you through how to make $1,000 or more selling websites to local businesses. So one of the first areas that I want to show you here is uh, the theme forest. So let's say you have a potential prospect uh, that is interested in getting a new website, getting their website developed, you know, new design. This is a great place in here to look for templates. So let's say that you had a uh, local, let's say dentist, and uh, they wanted to get a new website. I would recommend that you use WordPress platform because it's the easiest to work with. Uh, there's a lot of different platforms that you can use. There's Wix, uh, Magento, uh, you know, a bunch of other different platforms, but those can get quite complex and Wix, Sites are okay, they're all right, but uh, there are quite a bit of limitations. With WordPress, uh, it's quite easy for SEO to get set up, uh, quite easy for uh, the actual development and the setup, and it's the most popular uh, platform out there for building websites. So essentially, if you look at this one here, so this would be a good theme here to use. Now, the whole goal here and the key is to find a particular temp template that looks good uh, for your particular prospect. I would typically send them two to three different templates and say, hey, which one of these looks the best, right? Uh, would fit your brand, you know, the best. And then uh, we're going to go to, and I'm going to walk you through that, to another source where you're actually going to have somebody build out the website for you uh, for a very low cost, and you're able to make the difference, which is typically 75, 80, 90% uh, profit that you're going to be able to make because uh, you can get somebody overseas to build them for you. So this one here, I love this platform because uh, you get to see these examples essentially live and see how it's going to look like. I mean, this is a very, very high-end dentist site here. I mean, this is perfect. So let's say that we wanted to use this one here. Gosh, this one is very, very nice. Here's a calendar, a booking software. Wow, yeah, this is extremely nice. So you could easily sell this one for $2,000, $1,000, and that's kind of on the low end, $1,000, right? Because you can easily get somebody to build this uh, for you, set this all up for you, just kind of like the demo. Uh, for a hundred bucks, you know, if that, and I'll show you some resources for that. So let's say that we wanted to take a look at the different pages here. Yeah, I mean, this is just a fantastic site. Okay, so this template here is, let's say we wanted to use this template, okay? So we would go in here, we would buy this, and let me go down here. Okay, you would buy the WordPress plugin, okay, uh, to be able to install or the WordPress uh, actual site uh, data. And so don't have to worry about any of that as far as right now, because you can have your, uh, the guy that you're going to be actually outsourcing this to take care of that for you. So let me just kind of give you some more examples here. Let's say we're looking for uh, a different, let's say, a local construction business, let's say construction or landscaping. Okay, landscaping websites. Okay, we got some in here. And you can easily uh, break this down by different criteria here. So let's say you wanted to find uh, the best match, the best sellers, the, the trending, best rated. Let's say we want to break this down by best sellers. Okay, this one's more of a multi-purpose one. Yeah, this one looks really good here. Oh, nice. This one here is kind of a lead uh, gen page that is actually can be used for a lot of different things here. So let's take a look at this one here. Oh, nice. Okay, so they have, these are like landing pages, kind of pre-built. Uh, let's see here. Let's look at this one here. 
Um, I'm just walking through some examples here. I want to be able to give you a resource here so you can take a look at kind of what's available. Okay. Yeah, this is a nice site here. This is a nice little site that we, we could use. Great. Okay. So let's say that, uh, you know, you also wanted to look up uh, different uh, themes here. And there's another platform that I actually want to show you where you can find some more. And that one, I believe, is, I believe it's a theme monster, template monster. There we go. I've got a couple templates from there as well. And these ones are a little bit more higher end. Uh, and you'll notice that here. But let's go to WordPress. We want to make sure it's on WordPress. It's going to be the easiest to, to navigate through. Okay, so here we can see we have different categories. So let's say we wanted to find uh, something even for like a local restaurant. Okay, here are some different ones here. This looks like a little pizzeria place here. Oops. And here we can see a live demo as well. Okay, and this one's $75. So this is how it would look like. This is a nice type of template here uh, for like a local business. Very nice, very nice. Okay, great. So let's say that you have a prospect that is ready to go there uh, interested, you've sent them a few different examples. Um, I would like to send at least three and say, hey, which one of these three is is going to work best for your brand or do you like the best? Because if you're sending just kind of one every one every time and just like, hey, how does this look? Hey, how does this look? Uh, you're going to bombard them and a lot of times they're going to get, you know, they're going to be like, well, I don't know, send me another one, send me another one versus if you're like, hey, Here's these three themes that we feel are the, are the best for your particular business. Which one of these do you like the best? So now it's an either or versus, hey, show me some more, show me some more, right? Uh, unless you have, for some reason, you select really bad ones. But uh, if you go on Template Monster, if you go on Theme Forest, uh, you'll be able to find these quite easily. So uh, let's say we have the three themes that we got set up. The, the prospect, the client has selected, okay, I want this one here. So now what's the next steps? How do we get this uh, outsourced uh, for very, very minimal cost and actually, you know, execute on this? So this is where I go to Fiverr and where you can find people in here that are able to get you. Uh, let me go back to what's going on here. Let's say we want to find a website development. Okay, so this guy is talking about a hundred dollars. Okay, uh, let's look at this guy here. Let me see. Okay. Complete website with premium template with all required plugins plus backup one week support. So they'll set everything up for you. Let's even find one here where they can uh, set it up like demo. So let's go to duplicate this. Uh, set up website like demo. Okay, here we go. Because then you're going to be like, okay, I want you to set up this website exactly how it looks here. And then once you have this framework set up here, uh, then you can be like, okay, I want you to go in and add different text, right? So that it's catering to that specific business. So they'll handle all of it, right? You just got to tell them exactly what to do. Uh, and then uh, you're pretty much done and you deliver the actual website uh, to your client. And, and, you know, 
be able to do that time in and time out. Now, I like to say that typically uh, two weeks is what I like to, to give uh, anytime I'm doing you know website design, website development, because you want to have some time for back and forth and set the right expectations. So this guy here, um, this is a good setup because what they'll do, and they have good ratings here, 5.0, that's the highest rating. So $25, they'll set up the website exactly how it looks here. Nothing customized, but just exactly how it looks, right? And then if you want to do the standard package, they'll add the content and images to make your website look similar to demo using your content. Boom, right? Perfect. So $95, right? They'll set everything up. They'll add different images, content to the website, and they'll get everything ready to go for uh, your client. Or this one's for, for uh, longer pages. Let's say you had 10 pages on the website, 175, but 95 should be just enough for what you need there. Okay. And, you know, you can set this up and deliver a fully customized uh, website for your client there. Now, if you want to go and let's say you even find, um, I want to show you some tricks here. Let me type in, let me see here, Seattle dentist. I want to see something here. I want to show you how you can even find if these guys are running WordPress already. So let's go here. So a couple of different ways you can find this, or maybe, maybe let's say you want to find out what kind of theme these guys are using. So these guys are not using WordPress. Okay. Um, let's go back over here. I want to try to find one of these so they can see what kind of theme they're running. Okay. I think you're always going to find out if they're running uh, any type of WordPress platform. You can type in WP dash admin or hyphen admin. See if this pulls up. Cause that's going to be your login portal. Yep. These guys are on pla uh, the WordPress platform. So let's say we wanted to find, uh, let's go back here uh, and say, wow, this looks like a really nice theme here. I want to use this one. Uh, I want to be able to use this exact one has this type of design. So we would type in to Google what WordPress theme is at. What WP theme is that dot com. You go here, put in the URL and it would pull up what exact WordPress plugins and theme they're using. So they're using this one here, this one here, this one here. Okay. Now for this one right here specifically, it didn't pull up a specific theme, which means that it's, it means that it's customized and, and it's unique. It's, it's custom built, but it shows you the plugins that are being used. But uh, let's say that even if you don't want to be able to have uh, a theme, you know, developed from scratch, or you don't want to buy any one of these templates, uh, you can easily just come in here and uh, get one of these set up a custom website with these guys. You know, honestly, I wouldn't recommend that because it typically can become <laughs> a little bit clustered because so basically if you're going in here and you're like, hey, I want a whole new website. I want it to look cool. I want it to be for a dentist. Okay. And my budget's a couple hundred dollars. Well, they got to go and they got to, you know, come up with something unique out of, out of thin air and ask a lot of questions about, you know, what design type you like versus coming in here and just finding some simple themes, some really nice themes that are already set up properly, have them set them up like this one here, like we went through, have them set it up and then have you be able to just customize everything with the logo, the content and the images and um, be able to flip that for a thousand dollars plus. Um, you got a buddy of mine who does uh, a lot of these websites for local businesses, uh, and it cost him just, uh, because he has like a, a lifetime license on one of these, uh, it's like literally a hundred percent profit because, uh, he, he bought 
a let me see if we can even find local business uh, theme. He literally has a local business theme, and literally all he does is switch out uh, the colors, color schemes, and the logo, and it takes him 20 minutes to set everything up, and then he's able to charge thousand dollars plus for those websites because he has everything already set up the the theme he just installs it himself and changes a couple things and boom you're ready to go um i don't think they have one in here uh, no they don't let me even go back over here i know they have local business landing page those are the best kind of websites as well uh, that have kind of more of a landing page look because it allows you to collect information uh, for your prospect, right? For your for your actual client to be able to have a website that is actually converting when people land on there. Because a lot of times it's like a website will just be like, hey, look at us, look at what we do. This is how, how we can help you. But there's really no call to action there. So let's take a look at this one. Where was it? Okay, so this guy builds up landing pages. These are pretty nice. Okay. Yeah, so this is another resource here. But basically, I just wanted to kind of give you an overview here of the different options out there that are available uh, where you can start, you know, easily selling websites for, you uh, thousand dollars plus i mean i would even type in i would go to yelp you know a good place to find prospects for this yp.com because a lot of these guys in here are old school and they have yp.com has built their websites for them which is typically crap websites the you know and um they're kind of old school folks on here that need to get kind of with the digital age and so you come to them with you know a very nice looking site I mean, that's, that's going to be huge. So let's say, um, let's go construction or home remodel. See what pops up here. Okay. So let's see if these guys have a good site. Pioneer plumbing. Yeah. This site's nice. Um, Pioneer, oh, it's the same one. Okay, let's go here. La Polla Spray Foam. Yeah, I mean, uh, this site's all right. It could definitely use some revamping. Um, let's get out of there. Yeah. <laughs> And this is a yp.com site. You can even tell up here. Look at this. So, I mean, this site is just total crap, right? It, it really is. And so let's say we wanted to find like a painting site. Let's go back over here. Uh, just type in painting. Right, something like this here. This looks really nice. Let's go to live preview. How much is this? Fifty-three dollars. Super cheap. Yeah, I mean, this is a nice site here, right? You think about this one in comparison to uh, where is it at? <laughs> you look at this one here yp.com built i mean look at the url it's, it's just total crap and then versus this one here right you don't think they're gonna pay a thousand dollars fifteen two thousand dollars for a site like this i mean it's it's just such great opportunity for you and have somebody off fiverr uh set it up for you for a hundred bucks and you know let's say you even sell it for a thousand dollars that's nine hundred dollars in your pocket uh for you know flipping a website and you're not really doing any of the work. You're just essentially the middle guy. You're connecting the business owner with the new website and you're having somebody overseas implement it, install it, you know, execute on it um, at a very low cost. So 
Uh, that's it for this video here. Just wanted to show you some resources on where you can find different website themes. Once again, I recommend WordPress platform. It's uh, the one that's the most popular out there, easiest to work with, great for SEO. And if you really enjoyed this video, I would appreciate a like and subscribe, and we'll see you on the next one. Thanks.